This is the load that they helped me get at my honey hole this morning. We went to the first honey hole. You're not gonna believe it. We had a scrap pilot, uh, pirate, excuse me. A scrap pirate was stealing, stealing my stuff. And uh, the new manager didn't know um, that it wasn't me. He called and said, I told him I'd be there Friday. This guy showed up Friday. He literally thought it was me, he didn't talk to him. We got there to load it up and there was somebody loading my scrap metal from my honey hole. So I talked to the new manager, introduced myself, gave him my business card. He said that will never happen again. From now on, I get his metal. So we drove all the way to Shalot with Scrap and Scorpion, Jericho, prospecting, and uh, his wife and kid for nothing. But we were able to pick up this and get Greg loaded, so I think we did good. We did good. And they're getting ready to head on the road back to Virginia. Good morning, everybody. It is Saturday. Look what I got. New back window. Grandpa's blessed. I just feel good that I was able to um, replace it and and not have to struggle and worry about it. I would hate to be driving around with plastic in my back glass, but the good thing is we're heading to the scrapyard. Saturday morning, it's 9.31. We should get there about 10 o'clock. They close at 12, so that gives us plenty of time to go through the yard, maybe get some extra bonus footage. I'll see what I can do, see when we get there. Huh? That's a two pound bucket. Yeah. Oh, now it went up again, so 21. That's actually a 1.7 pound bucket, but because <laughs> the handle's missing. Yeah. Two pound, close enough, 22, 20, uh, 21 pounds. Okay, three, two. Number two. And then. That's the clean brass. Clean 15 brass. pounds. Oh, we weighed up the dirty one first? No, 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 I already weighed this one. That's yeah. the clean. Yeah, I already weighed that one. That's the dirty. The no. Dirty brass. Look at there, 32 pounds. Beautiful. Buck 40 for dirty. Yeah. 220 for clean, that what you said? No, uh, 240. 240 for clean. Yeah. I'm good with all that if you want. Yeah, looks good to me. 14 times, 2.4. I figured I'd need to bring in some stuff so I can pay for my window. Yeah, definitely. 143.50? Yeah. So Beautiful. 144. Beautiful. Perfect. Beautiful number. That's what I needed. And three buckets. That's, so that's what I needed. Yeah, I need my buckets back. Yeah. Beautifulness. $145 before I even go to the scrapyard. Southern Metal. Boy, this place is cleaned up. They definitely got to let me fly my drone down here soon because what they said was, let us get it cleaned up and then we'll let you fly your drone. So, let me go in the non ferris this morning. Saturday, baby. Grandpa is going to be watching the UFC tonight. Ultimate Fighting Championship. It's a beautiful Saturday. Blessed. Man, where you been? I'm at the other yard. Huh? Cut it out. What other yard? On um, third and right. Oh, no thing. I mean. Mm -hmm. <laughs> got me a new back glass. Got a lot of... Just a little bit of non-ferrous. Not much, though. Okay. We'll take care of it. Yeah, I got that radiator. Is that that uh, dirty aluminum engine block? What else I got in this thing? Little of this, little of that. Mostly just scrap. I got that one engine right there. Oh yeah. I got a prop. Cast aluminum prop. I think that's that's probably clean. And then this dirty motor here.
Cast aluminum prop. Five pounds. Just drop it five. Yeah. Yeah, baby. Beautiful day. I got a dirty electric motor. I say dirty. I. It was so rusted I couldn't take that damn piece off unless I just hit it with a hammer and that still wouldn't have cleaned it up. So. Yeah, I've been uh, thinking about you. Yeah, I was gonna ask them boys what in the world happened to Pops. Yeah, you like it over there? You might. You rather be here? Yeah. Yeah, I hear you, bro. This is an awesome place. That's why. This is just an awesome place. This is my favorite place. You know what? When I, I dumped off when I first started scrapping, they were taking metal over there, and I dumped there one time. I got a video of it. Okay. Yeah, I sure That's do. It, That's it, buddy. Yeah. Now I got to cross the scale and go out back. All right. The other day I come in here, and uh, I, don't, I didn't have much on there, maybe 300 pounds or so. I went from here straight. Okay, Grandpa. Huh? I said they fucked. Hey, man. No, no, no. He took care of me. Oh, did? Yeah, he did. He took care of me. They always do, man. This place. Okay. I was honest. I said, look, I had three or four hundred pounds. He, he okay. gave me. He paid me three hundred pounds. So. All right. I'm blessed, you know what I mean? I'm honest with everybody, so, you know, if you're honest with everybody, they ain't going to try to take anything from you. Right. Appreciate you, guy. Uh -huh. Nice seeing you again. Uh -huh. You just... My arm is absolutely killing me, guys. I ain't lying. Killing me. Right now, he's looking out the window thinking, there he goes again. That come across the scale. I'm just turning around going going the other way one way or the other I'm gonna have to do it anyway so I might as well do it now here we go stop on the scale wait for buzzer proceed that's what I'm gonna do all right guys we got uh, we got 11 11 540 11 it's kind of bouncing a little bit Let me see, 11.5. I'm guessing I got 1,200 pounds. That's, I think that's what I said earlier, so let's see if I was right. This place, man. They have really, really, really cleaned this place up. Gosh. Although them piles in the back there is getting a little high. Yeah, this is uh, pretty daggum amazing. I know they're about ready for me now. Yes, sir. What's going on, buddy? Let's go, Grandpa. Yeah. <laughs> All right, let's get this thing back then. Yeah, beep, beep, beep. And I'm not going to be able to dump it. That's why I backed up straight to him. So he can see it while he's unloading it. I just told him that way he knows he has to drag it let me get out of the way let him do his thing I, I back straight up to him so he can watch that load come out yes sir nice stuff nice stuff right there goodness gracious great on the fire Southern metal. Recycling, Wilmington, North Carolina. Grandpa's favorite place. I don't necessarily want to work here. I just I just like coming here. I just like coming here. Wouldn't mind running one of them machines one time now. This is uh, this is some pretty good metal right here. This is better than washers and dryers, at least. Yeah, buddy. How you doing, today, buddy? You got a lot of 
me a new window. Ah, I, yeah. I broke it out the other day. Yeah? I threw a wheelbarrow in here and smashed it. It's on video. Dang, I'll go look at it. I've been checking so, out video. It's on video. You know, you came out with your grandson, I went and looked at that video. I just, I'm putting that wheelbarrow in there and I says, Grandpa was trying to break something and just as I dropped that thing and smashed the damn window right out. Yeah. No. You too, brother. Thank you. Beautiful day. This is the stuff that Strapping Scorpion, Jericho, Samantha, and Junior helped us load. A beautiful day let me get the rest of this off of there we can go Jericho, Samantha, and Junior, thank you for helping me load this load. We're gonna go see how much we uh, how much we're gonna get for it. Stick around. All right, Greg. Thirteen hundred and eighty pounds of uh, shred metal. Um, a little under a hundred dollars. So that's what we picked up. That cast aluminum motor that I got from the place I broke my back window out at, I got $2 for that. No, wait a minute. I got $13.86 for that. It's 22 pounds. And then uh, cast aluminum prop that I picked up with Jericho and Scrap and Scorpion, that little broken prop, that was $2. Aluminum radiators. I brought one aluminum radiator in. It was 13 pounds, $5.20. And then that one dirty aluminum uh, pool motor that was all rusted and I couldn't even get the anything apart on it. I got 10 cents a pound for that at 34 pounds. So for a grand total, $121.06. And I met Aaron's daughter. She when she met we met each other here at the uh, scrapyard. So hello young lady, it was nice meeting you. Hope you get to see this video. All right, guys, till next time, what's next, what's next, what's next, Scramble Grandpa. Oh, yeah, real quick, for a recap, $140 this morning at my first non-Ferris stop. Uh, Scrapple with Scorpion knows this guy. He's a friend of mine. He buys scrap metal because his brother actually buys it back from him. His brother is a um, scrapyard owner, just not here. So I made 140 there this morning, and then that 121 here, $260. We almost got my back glass paid for. <laughs>